Back. A Memphis woman experienced a double tragedy when she lost both her husband and her son in separate car crashes. Really heartbreaking yeah. situations. Her church family has been there for her each time, but now they're going a step further to pass it on to relieve some of the recent financial strain. Her name is Mamie Humphrey, and she's uh, my church sister. We grew up in the church uh, old days, old time church, and uh, we've been knowing each other for at least about close to 30 years. Mary Lovett and Lisa Tynes go to church with Mamie Humphrey at Love Fellowship Ministries in Southeast Memphis. Lisa has suffered two devastating losses. In August 2021, her husband Frederick was killed when he lost control of his car and crashed. This past May, she lost her youngest son, 25-year-old Malik, when the family says a speeding driver slammed into Malik's car and killed him on impact compounding his mother's problems while picking up food for her son's memorial, someone stole her car. I've mean, just been telling she's a strong woman and she's strong. So I just wanted to just encourage her to keep on being that person that she are. And regardless of what's going on in the world around us, to stay focused and, and just be encouraged. All right, we have we count out the six hundred dollars in cash. From News Channel Three mm -hmm. and another one hundred, two hundred, three hundred from our anonymous donor. Okay, thank you so much. All right. All right, let's go pass it on. All right. When we get to Mamie's home, she's sitting inside her garage. Mary explains she brought along WREG to pass it on. Hold out your hand. I'm gonna count this out to you. One. Two, three hundred from Channel Three News. One, two, three, three hundred from an anonymous donor. And I hope you can get your medicines and, you know, more easily without have to go through your pocket or whatever. I know it's been rough for you, and we love you. <laughs> the thoughtfulness is met by a tight embrace between the friends and church members. A sign this act of compassion is not only appreciated but needed at this time in Mamie's life. I'm so thankful um, that I have friends like this. I'm just thankful. Mamie replaced the stolen car, but she has to pay for her own mounting doctor bills and medications as she struggles with the emotions of losing her husband and then three years later, Malik. My son was killed in an um, accident. A guy ran the red light, they was racing, and he, he was killed. It's through prayer. I know God is with me. I know he's with me. Because I'm nothing without him. All that I have, God is all that I have right now. Good she has her faith to hold on to at this time.